Paul Rath? Another fumble? Can you believe that? These guys are push leagues. I mean, come on, amateurs. So Kent and I have been friends for years. Our kids have gone to school together since they were little, and for several years now we've been watching the games together every Sunday. Oh my god! Again? Unbelievable. Dude, These it was, guys. It was fine. It was a good call. No, terrible. The, the ref needs, the ref needs glasses, fine. man. Don't even try. Fine. Nonsense. Boo! Not even. Eh. It used to be a blast. Our families would come over, we'd uh, make a day of it. It was a lot of fun. Now, everything he does seems to tick me off. Several years ago, my mom died on game day, and it was around then that things started to get worse. Now Kent's just overdramatic with the booze and the food and the bad calls and the always yelling. Both of our families left us years ago, so now it's just us. Uh, uh, I don't know. I don't know. I really like a lot of orange seed. This is a good football game. Oh my god, you're kidding me. Really? No way. What's wrong with that? No, it's ridiculous. You complain about every you know, single play. They were playing fine earlier. I think it's these two. I think they're the problem. What does I that think, have to do with them? Because they jinxed the whole thing. Now they're playing like crap. Seriously. Fuck you, what? Kent. Whatever. Hey, you got the better food? Food? Yeah. Really? Absolutely. Are you kidding me? I'm serious. I'm at the point where one more thing, and I'm gonna have to tell him that we can't do this together anymore on Sundays. I've just had enough. What the fuck? Another bad call, Ralph? These guys need to invest in better refs. This is just ridiculous. I'm going to the town, man. Keep watching the game and don't go in the freezer. Mm. Hey Ben, you got any real food, man? In the pantry or on the top part of the fridge? All right, thanks. Just don't go in the freezer. Thank you. Kent, don't go in the freezer. What the fuck, man? I don't know if he's a good hot pocket, ma'am. It's a little stale, though. How long have you had this thing for? That's the last thing my mom gave me before she died. That hot pocket's been in the freezer for three years. Wait a second. You had it for that long? You can't eat it because it's cursed. Well, it's a little stale, but not bad for a three-year-old hot pocket. It's pretty good. Well, you, you don't understand, man. Anytime I can get out of the house, you know, and away from the kids. I hear you. Right? Kids are already on. All right. Let's have some fun. What the hell, man? I tried to warn him. Oh, he ate your mom's cursed hot pocket. Yeah. I tried to warn him not to go in the freezer, but he wouldn't listen. Uh, rookie mistake. Whoa, did you see that play? Oh, oh man! man. Oh! Hey, you think he's gonna eat that hot pocket? Nah, I don't think so. 12 years, man. <laughs> <laughs>